Alright, welcome back to another video on the channel. Hopefully you guys are all having a great day. So today what I have for you guys is another video on my Josh TKO account. I actually recorded this video before yesterday's video, but that bundle is actually fairly new and I wanted to get that up before posting this. But recently I've been going through the comment section on the videos where you guys suggest weapons for me to use on this account. And the weapons I've seen you guys suggest the most is a sniping only video, which I will do here in the near future. The Diamatis, the FFAR, and the M79. And today I decided to use the M79 because I've seen a ton of people asking me to use this weapon. This weapon is hands down the worst weapon you could possibly ever use in Warzone in close quarters combat. I'm sure I'm going to have some gameplay in the background showing you guys how bad this thing actually is up close when you direct impact people because this weapon actually works like a noob tube did back in the old Call of Duty games where when you're too close to somebody it actually doesn't blow up and it only direct impacts them. Well Warzone is entirely different than multiplayer. In multiplayer it's a one hit one kill when you direct impact someone. In Warzone it only does a max damage of like one plate. So if you do direct impact somebody you'll have to melee them two more times with the gun to kill them. And then on top of that every single time you shoot it you have to reload it and it also has no attachments. I really do think this weapon could be good if the damage was increased on direct impacts. Like if you're close range to somebody and you direct impact somebody, it either downs them or full kills them. But with how the weapon is now and how little damage you do from direct impacting somebody in close quarters, it's just, in my personal opinion, the worst weapon in the entirety of Warzone. And in most situations in the gameplay and just overall when I was using this weapon, I just found it more effective to just run around with it like it's a melee weapon. Because realistically, all it really shoots is those little annoying styrofoam balls that you get in packages. But nonetheless, in the gameplay, I actually hit some pretty cool snipes at the beginning. Hopefully you guys do end up enjoying it. As always, let me know down below in the comment section any other weapons you guys would like to see me use next on the channel. And you know what? I'm going to go ahead and make a deal with you guys. The weapon that actually gets the most likes down below in the comment section is the weapon I'll use next on this account. But anyways, hopefully you guys end up enjoying the gameplay. If you do, drop a like down below, man. Let's shoot for 12,000 likes. Just because the struggle I had to go through to get a good gameplay with this weapon. Also, if you're brand new to the channel, I'd really appreciate it if you drop me a sub. And if you haven't already, turn on post notifications so you never miss out on an upload. Anyways, without further ado, let's go and hop into it. <laughs> Took that man out. I don't know. Maybe I need to do a sniping video, bro. Maybe I just need to. Those were some crispy shots. Not like I'm saying I'm the next face testy or anything here, but like that was pretty freaking good for me. Two people flying in. I can barely hit people standing still. Wow, he actually hit me. All right, I'm gonna get out of here. That was not what I was wanting to do, but he shot at me and I had seen him at the corner of my eye, so... I thought we would just go ahead and push them in that situation. Probably not the smartest of ideas with my subpar gun skill. Oh, oh, I see you too, buddy. Wow, I'm actually... We have four kills here. 7,400, which isn't, which isn't bad. Hello, door. I hate how when a vehicle gets close to a door, you can't bust it open. Never understood that. Oh. oh, almost testing my luck too much there. Well, you have five kills right now. Hey, getting out the vehicle actually works most of the time. Working pretty good here. Uh, we'll pick up some plates. I'll take that heartbeat. Is that a custom? No, this is pistol. Okay. That was a custom LMG. I don't even know if I wanted to pick that up anyways. Hmm. All right, someone got a loadout over there. <laughs> if six kills before loadout man it's not bad there we go we got our m79 okay, he's over there um is there a bertha yeah there's a bertha there i wonder if we can get to this bertha without dying this vehicle does not have much health if somebody shoots us up a little bit we're done but if we can make it to this bertha we should be fine man i just want to get a couple direct impacts of this thing Whenever you don't direct impact somebody, it's it's rough, bro. It's like straight up shooting styrofoam at people. Oh, wow. Nope. Nope. <laughs> okay. I guess we'll go over here. We have self res, so we don't have to buy self res. Uh, when you're in situations like that, it's better off for you to melee people with the weapon than it is for you to shoot them. Because if you shoot somebody that close with this weapon, it's not going to go well for you, bro. It's really not. 
Oh, there's one there. Okay. This man have a trophy here? Can't remember if he did or not. I don't think so. All right, two people there that are fighting. There's one there, actually. Maybe we should go for this dude in storage. Maybe inside of this cubby? Yep, yeah, there he is. Just so you guys know, that's what it does when you shoot somebody this close. Not a good idea. Not a good idea in any way, shape, or form to do that. Trust me. It does absolutely no damage. You still have to melee, melee them like twice after, so... It's just not even worth doing. That's why I just rather melee them and just move on and we'll try to end up getting a kill later on. Direct impacting. Okay. Go after our bounty then. I actually have eight kills right now. This could turn into a... I, I don't really say anything. I'm gonna jinx it if I say anything. Alright, so he's camping inside. Hmm. You know what? I feel like going back, getting a UAV just to make sure there's not multiple people camping here. So I don't get myself killed. That's the best bet here. I wanted to kill him and I want that bounty money, but it's just not worth it. There's multiple people in that building. I end up going in there and getting myself killed. Oh man, this, this guy actually dipped out. He left the building. We go after the guy in loadouts. Nah, he's dipping back to the back side of storage. That's not really worth it. There's two people fighting out here. We gotta get out here fast so we can see. They're like trailing each other. They probably don't even know each other there. Wow, there's three. Nah, that one's ghosted. My, my bounty died. Okay. Well, he killed him under there. Two people died here. That was a big bag. Yep, stopping power rounds are useless to us. You can't put them on the rocket launcher, which sucks. Wait, oh, there's a guy. I don't understand how he was shooting me up like that. <laughs> one hit, one kill, brother. He backed out. At least we got one direct impact. I'm trying, guys. Trust me. I just don't want to get myself killed to some BS. Now, I've done it a lot today. I have I went up to people and just ended up getting myself killed because what I did was just a bad decision. The crazy thing is I can't even remember if we've been to the Gulag yet this game or not. I have absolutely no idea. I feel like I have been and played so damn much today. But I'm dedicated to get this video done. I am. I say we get out of here. We get a UAV going somewhere. Maybe like there. I don't... I don't want to push this. I feel like that would just be a horrible idea. I, n I never go for bounties that are in train station. There's so many different levels. So many different places for people to camp. Play weird. Not worth it. Something I was actually talking about when I was playing. And I was thinking about in general was blackout. And the trip mines or the trip wires they had in there, bro. It was ridiculous. You could not drive a vehicle over bridges or anything because there would be like a trip mine over the bridge. I used to play a decent amount of Blackout, believe it or not. I just never really got into the knifing, knifing on it like that. Oh, well, you're dead, buddy. That's Rain. You slap over. I don't know what you were expecting there. Oh, there's two people in Super. Ah, I just... I don't know if I should take this into Super. <laughs> I don't think so. I should not take this, uh, this rocket launcher in Super. That is just a bad idea waiting to happen. I can't zoom in my mini-map. No way. Am I lagging out the game? Okay, I was about to say, I couldn't zoom in my mini-map there. I was just like, I guess it's bugged out, but... Man, I just, I don't even know what kind of a lag spike that was. That was horrible. Dude, what is this right now? Are they trying to nerf me mid-game? Is that what they're doing? I need to get inside. Bro, I can't even move. What is this? I... I'm going to end up getting killed here, dude. Dude, my ping. Look at that. Not even available how bad my ping is. 999. I don't know what to do. I guess we'll just sit in the building. We'll just wait until this uh, this horrible lag spike's over with. Oh, wait. It looks like we might have went back to normal connection. 40, 50 ping. Hey, there we go. Back to normal. Sometimes you just got to wait it out. What the heck was that? I don't know. At this point, I think I'm just going to drive around a bit. Um, I kind of want to see if this Bertha has full health. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Might as well go and get the fresh one. It's just sitting there. Okay. That's where the final circle is going to be. It might actually end up being a open final. I'm just trying to see if there's anybody camping in these houses. You are fighting over here somewhere. It's like right there. There we go. What do you have? Uh, nothing I could really... Uh, that's a pretty big bag, isn't it? 
Yeah, 5900. That was worth it. And most of my kills are with other guns other than the M79 and then also running people over. All I want to do is get a kill with this thing in game. That's all I want to do, baby. <laughs> the worst weapon in all of Warzone. Anybody land on this? Oh, no, nobody landed on it, but there's someone camping in here. That's for sure. No way, bro. Here we go. I'm just gonna kill you with that. Ah, uh, those houses seem to be... Oh, that's not a house, is it? Ah, uh, there's one inside, though. We could go for him. I don't want to get shot from somewhere else, though. Oh, wow, that was an elimination. Damn, not half bad. Shot the vehicle up a little bit. Was there somebody in here camping? I don't think so. Ooh. See what I'm saying? It's hard to kill people like that, bro. How oh, my vehicle's gone now. Damn, he blew it slap up, didn't he? I'm just gonna airstrike it. I had to try it. There was a dude here. Yep, he's there. There we go. Took him out. Maybe we got 15 right now, man. This might be stupid. Going out in the open here. Yep. All right, we made it in, we're good. That other building would have probably been a better fit than this. Ooh, I don't know about this, bro. Okay. That little building's still in the safe zone. Someone's sniping over there. Yep, they're fighting. I'm just gonna hope no one's backside over here. We can just quickly get over this building. I don't wanna get shot from over there either. Nope. There's that one. Okay, he's on the back side. There's also this other guy with the sniper to my right. I mean, I'm dead here, bro. Oh, we won, I think. No. We lost. We fucking lost, bro. There's no way. We lost. We lost. Dang, man. That sucks. He, he stuck me with it. I I even downed him. I hit him once too, bro. Oh my god. Man, that sucks. I wasted too much time on that guy down. I should have just thermited him and moved on. You know, it's not a big deal. I don't, I don't have to win, but that would have felt real good to win there with that weapon. I've been playing with it all day. I've been having the worst of luck using it. Uh, oh well, we ran the kills up pretty high, especially for the weapon that we were using. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it, man. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Fourth quarter shot, you know I get a ball and money in my pocket. No, I'm no stranger to ball.